Do you know Salman Khan was a bodybuilder? <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our Stupid Reactions Needed. I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram and Twitter for all juicy content. Follow us there, and we're not kidding, it's juicy. Bing! And uh, thank you for the social on Patreon, follow the official Twitter account. And, uh, Bing. I don't know. I liked it. I was squeezing the teat of justice. <laughs> I thought you were going to say the teat of the universe like we did. No. No, it's the teat of, everything has a teat, by the way. The teat of justice. Yep, justice, uh, does, freedom. But, uh, Your mom, ew. Today is uh, Salman Khan's birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. And we did a song, but no shock, blocked. Uh, <laughs> so that's on Patreon. Thank you so much for our exclusive Patreon support. But uh, it, it, we are going to do 12 surprising facts about Salman Khan. We haven't done okay. one of these 12 stories. We did one about SRK. I think we did one yes. about Rithik. Yes. And obviously this is another one of the big stars. I wonder if they did one about Amitabh Bachchan. I'm a dog buck John. And we know whenever we do these kind of things, we don't know if these facts are real. Yep. So you can tell us if they are incorrect. Well, yeah. if, we have, if we got them on the internet, they're all true. That's true. Everything you read on the internet yep. is 100% You factual. know who said that? Abraham Lincoln. But here we go. Because we don't know a lot about Salmon. We've we seen don't. one film of his. We have. Uh, but we know he, people love him. We do. Or absolutely despise There's him. There's no middle ground. <laughs> it is quite divisive. Here we go. Wow, he's oh. young. What's happening, guys? Welcome back to MTV. Yeah, I remember him. I haven't seen him in a while. And we're doing an episode on Salman Khan. So after we did our I can't video tell you on Salman Khan, 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 a lot of you guys are talking about <laughs> you. Why well, Salman Khan? So yeah, definitely we have to do it. Now this guy is a mega popular Bollywood star. He's estimated to be worth two hundred million dollars. <laughs> he makes more than Hollywood You're almost actors like Leonardo almost. DiCaprio, Dwayne the Rock Johnson, Brad Pitt, and even Johnny Depp. Now this video is requested by this guy right here, Kunal Jaswal, who also gave us a fact about Salman is that Khan you that we're going to be that introducing thing? in this video. As well as Kunal this video was also requested by Stylo Prince. Saja, Tech versus Tech, and a bunch of other people. All right, so let's jump into the facts. Now, Salman Khan, he began his acting career when he was just 23 years old. It was for a supporting role in a movie, Biwi Hoto Aisi, and that was back in 1988. Dang. He's so skinny. So slender. Wow. After that, he got his breakthrough leading role in his next film, and that was Main PR Kia in 1989. Now, this performance was so good that he won a Filmfare Award for best male debut. Now, although he's a super popular actor, did you know that he doesn't read any of his movie reviews? Whether the movie is a hit or whether the movie is just a big flop, Probably smart. You don't care what people have to say about it. I guess that's what kind of adds to his edge. Honestly, you know, if you're that big of an actor, you that his name is Salman Khan. Well, it kind of is, but no, his full name is actually Abdul Rashid Salim Salman Khan. His favorite actress is Hima Malini, as well as his favorite actor is Sylvester Stallone, who actually actually wants to do a movie with Salman Khan. And thanks to Kunal Jadzwal for That's that. That's not surprising, fact. though. Right. That's awesome. Issues. You can we're tell he's always about, cared yeah, about his body, and so, so you know. So much dollars yep. in Bollywood. I want to know, how much money do you want to make? Let me know down there. A also, lot. if you are a fan of Salman Khan, <laughs> you that like Now, Salman Khan loves Chinese food. As a matter of fact, his favorite Chinese restaurant he's is so the skinny in the beginning. In not Mumbai. now. And this one was pretty interesting. He also has a weird obsession with soap. His bathroom is completely stacked with natural soaps. Well, it's been said that he smells really good, so I guess that's part of it. But not everything is not a fact that's about you. Licks and glamour for Salman Khan. <laughs> he actually suffers from trigeminal neuralgia, and that is a facial nerve disorder known as the suicide disease. It is a no problem. And then when it did the no problem, then that no problem suddenly became a small thing and this aneurysm became a big thing. Basically what it is, is an intense pain in the face that originate from the trigeminal nerve. Ouch. But yeah, that's not enough to ruin that pretty face. For those of you who follow Salman Khan's career, so you face, probably know already that he's hurts. the son of a famous Indian film actor and writer, Salim Khan. But what you may not, not know that. was that from the beginning, Salman Khan was a fighter. You know, when he went to auditions and everything. 
He never used his father's name to get a role. So he wanted to get a role based on his skills. He didn't want to but get did it based people know on oh, who his father was, of regardless. A famous Indian film star and writer. No, nah, he wanted to get the roles based on his own talent and paint his own way, which he definitely did. Not only is this guy a huge success, but he's also very giving. Um, back in 2007, he started the Being Human Foundation. And what this organization does is to support the underprivileged people in India. The organization works with private companies to help poor people with education as well as health care. Now, in terms of his religious background, if you check several biographical sources about it, you'll see that Salman Khan's religion is listed as Hindu and Muslim. Now, this this is due to the fact that he said in the past that he's both Muslim and Hindu, but really he has no religion. It's because his mother was Hindu and his father was Muslim. Mm -hmm. like, I don't know, can you be two religions at the same time? That's an interesting one. Let me also know your thoughts about that down there. Uh, now in his film, Dog uh, uh, Tiger, he starred in the movie with Katrina Cave, and that became the second highest earning Bollywood in film in history, because so. it grossed nearly $57 million in 2012. People love that movie. Jasusun! Bye. Now, the tiger. being a huge success in acting, he also has several other skills. He's a painter, he does photography, like he's also an excellent swimmer, as well as a pretty good singer. So that's he it. actually so if you this video, those are your facts on Salman Khan. Wow. There's a ton of other yep. information that obviously we couldn't fit in this video. So if you also want a part two to Salman, you know. I, you know what I would like to see? A video based on Indian actors' real voices. Which actors have the best real voice? You mean as far as their singing voice? Their singing voice. Yeah. Because yeah, be interesting. obviously, as some of them have talked about, like when Ranveer and Shahid talked about it in, in, in the, the, the round table, mm -hmm. a lot of them want to. Right. But why aren't they given the option? That's what... <laughs> well, because they probably can't. Like, based on his singing in Swedes, yes, we know it's not pronounced that way. <clears throat> no, it's pronounced Swedes. Uh, I don't think SRK can sing. Because mm. he has that moment where he's bathing and he's singing and it's terrible. Yeah? Yeah. Is he actually singing at them? Yeah, it's actually him. Oh, yeah. And I don't know if what he was... What was he singing? I don't know if he was doing that on purpose. Was it singing? was an American song. Oh, it was a rock song. It was a rock song. It was either American or British, but it was oh, a Western yeah, 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 yeah. song. I'm oh, sorry. But he, he was singing it and I remember thinking, ah... Oh, I wonder if he's singing that way just to sing that way for the character, or if maybe SRK just really isn't a great singer. Oh yeah, and uh, obviously but, uh, Big B, Big B's got a nice voice, but he's he's not like a, a, wouldn't be considered. I wonder a, a if great singer. I wonder if it'll ever change, uh, like they'll ever because like if you like it did here, yeah, yeah, because yeah. like if here, if you're in a musical, you're gonna have to sing that musical almost always. almost all ninety five percent yeah, of the time. almost only. And in fact, I think the only person who doesn't do their own singing in Greatest Showman was I forgot her name, but she's she's the the opera singer that he falls in love with. Yeah, it's one of the greatest lip syncs I've ever seen on film because the actual singer isn't her. But I, I think you all know that. Uh, Zac Efron did his own singing in that, which to his credit, after the High School Musical first one, he said, I don't want someone else singing my vocals. I want to I wanna sing. Uh, and I wonder if it'll ever change. Hugh Jackman is obviously there. Yeah. And everybody in Les Mis sang their own stuff live. Yeah, I'm, I just wonder if it'll ever fully change to... Uh... I don't know. It's interesting because India's vocal stuff is very different than ours in terms yeah. of the singers are as big if not bigger stars sometimes yeah. than the actors than the actors where that's not no. that wasn't the case here no uh but yeah i, I, I didn't know any of this stuff yeah i didn't it's it, it it is cool to see because obviously you're a big fan of stallone yeah. himself but it's not surprising no that, not if, if i was to think of salman khan and who his favorite American actor would be, I think I would actually immediately say... I think Stallone. Stallone. Uh, yeah. Or Arnold Schwarzenegger. Yeah, I it, would... It would be one of those two that I... That would be my first guess would be his favorite. Yeah, I love that that's his uh, favorite. I love that also he's a painter. I wonder if... I wonder if that was something Sly inspired in him because Sly's a painter as well. Um, I also... I, I, I would like to know as much about all of the people like here... I just want to know everything that makes them who they are. Yeah. Because then when I watch them, it, I, I, there's just there's more for me to know about them as an artist. And yeah, and obviously, do. regardless of if you like him or not, he is probably minimum top five biggest stars in India. 
In the world. And, and yeah, like, in the world. At minimum. Yeah, at minimum. Minimum. Um, but like, so like we, sh we should know more about him, regardless of if you like him or if you don't. <laughs> we do need to give him a song, though. We need to give him something. What? You know? Oh, but, but we have, the... there's some other people we haven't done that for. It just needs to come naturally. Yeah. It shouldn't, you know, Rithic and SRK just happen out of nowhere. Huh. Right? Yeah, I don't know what it would be. I keep trying Man, to figure it out. When it's supposed to happen, it'll happen. But for those of you who are unaware, you really should look into all of the Mr. Olympias that Salman Khan has won. I think he's uh, won more Mr. Olympias than Ronnie Coleman. I know this one is uh, quite popular. This right here. I think that's Ashwarya Rai and... Uh, well done. Look at you calling her Ashwarya Rai. I think we have one like a Bengali pronunciation. Did you know how you Rai? And then I think there's another one with SRK. Uh, Salmon and SRK. Um, but yeah, oh, also I wanted to know, it, I, I know it said he didn't use his, his family name to get roles. Right. But did people already know? Like right. since that his this father was, was such a big guy, did, like he walks on the door and you're like, that's Salmon Khan, he's using a different name. Why yeah. is he doing that? Yeah. <laughs> so like, did, is like, is that just something he says and people knew regardless that was that's who it was? Or maybe he did make it on his own. I don't know. I'm looking forward to the comment thread on this one because we've seen some comments before and I've had messages before and this will be polarized. It always is with some. Yep. I feel like. More than anybody else, and though we've only watched one of his films, whenever there's been someone out of India, someone out of Bollywood and to be particular, People have said they either love him or they detest him. Yeah. There's, there's there no, is no middle ground. You know who else is similar? Not as bad. But in terms of his films, is Renbeer. Like, people, like, either, that's, that's their guy, or right? they almost hate every single one of his films and think they're overrated. Yeah, but there's not like this, I feel like, oh, no, no, the Salman Khan fans will burn your house down. Uh, yeah. Yeah. But also the Salman Khan fans will as well if you say anything nice about him. <laughs> <laughs> like we got a comment that said it's stupid that y'all are just appeasing your fans to like Salman Khan. We're like, we're not. We're not. But we should know about him. Yeah. Like you can't just ignore you one of the biggest stars in, in India. India. Exactly. It's like okay. also when the in the one film we saw so far, he did not hurt the film. I know. Mean, obviously, we said. He's not really a, a good yeah, actor. We, we're, we're, we didn't immediately throw him in there with the, the likes of the people that would be award-winning actors, but no. he wasn't bad. No. And he, we, we, we enjoyed tell, him. You could tell he was struggling. Like I, like I said, and I think I got confirmed when we did it, it's his charm that people like so much. He's a lot Which, to me like Dwayne Johnson. Yeah. He seems to be like a guy who's worked really hard, mm -hmm. whose personality is very charming. Yeah. And is is probably works and does the most he can with what he's got. And yeah. that's, I, that's admirable to me. Well, happy birthday, sir. I don't know happy how birthday. old you are. What do you think? 50? I bet, I bet he's right in the wheelhouse of the early 50s. Your age? Yeah, about my age probably. Yeah. And Amir Khan. They're, yeah. they're in that same. And SRK. They're all in their early 50s. Yeah. Yep. Well, happy birthday, sir. Happy birthday.